where a former star athlete at Paris Independent High School was shot and killed. While police investigate the homicide, those who knew Jacoby Wells are trying to focus on his life instead of his death. LAX 18's Lee Searcy has the story. Dude, that charismatic spirit, man. Uh, like I said, when he's the kid that you meet that you don't forget. Everyone from coaches to teammates to local officials remember Jacoby Wells as a standout player on and off the field. His senior year, Wells was MVP of the 2017 Paris Greyhounds All-A State Championship team in basketball. And according to his football coach, was a commanding leader when his team struggled. You know, Jacoby's one of those guys that was a walking highlight reel. He made big impact plays. Coach Brian Washington says he recently ran into Wells. You know, every time I see these guys, even though they've played for me, uh, they still those kids that played for you. I see them as uh, you see them in the huddle, you know, or in the locker room or in the school district. They're still those innocent children. Police are still trying to figure out what happened. They say just after 5.30 Monday evening, Wells was in a car with two other young men when he was shot somehow and stumbled up to Williams Street before collapsing in the road. Police tell us as neighbors administered CPR, the two men with Wells pulled up here, then suddenly left before officers arrived. They're checking home security cameras to see if anything was caught on video. Investigators hope if you know something, you'll give them a call. Meanwhile, it's still so surreal for those who knew Wells. Right now, and this community is just looking for some hope. So my hope is that, you know, in sharing all these memories of Jacoby, to realize that life should be valued and not wasted. In Bourbon County, Lee Searcy, LEX 18 News. Right now, Paris police want to talk to the two men with Wells, the CEO, just what they know. Call police if you have any information.